All right, here we are. Part two of the eBay trash uh, one piece at a time. So I have taken apart the television that we had in the first uh, part there um, that I showed you. And these are the parts that I intend to resell. And I'm not sure exactly what the cost was. Get in focus there. Uh, of the television at the time that we purchased it. Uh, I don't know if it was new. I can't remember. But I thought based upon the results that I get here on these parts. I'll be happy with that amount and its replacement. The stand. It's going to go for about 30 bucks. Uh, I will be doing all best offers on these items. So except for the cord. The cord's going to go for about $10. The power board is about, uh, let's see, what did we say that was going to go for? That's about $29 or best offer. Uh, the TCOM board, which seems to be a very common thing that goes out on these televisions because um, there's quite a few of them on the comps on eBay. Uh, that's about a $20 board right there. The power button goes anywhere between $10 to $15. The screws, actually, these actually go to this uh, stand. But the remaining screws I'm going to pop on there, um, they're asking like $7 for them. Um, let's see. Uh, that would have been for 8 So we're, you know, we've got some more in the, in the bucket over here. The main board, I've seen it as high as the asking of $480. Uh, I've seen it sold for as low as 15 so it's all over the board. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to say 75 bucks or best offer. The Wi-Fi, this is pretty interesting. I thought about maybe keeping this for a project. Um, but then again, it's a $20 item. And it might be better sold than sitting around until I get around to the project, which would include these speakers, which I thought would be kind of cool to put in something. And then I realized, eh, 15 to $20. So there's $40. There's a questionable 75 for sure. 30. You've got 20. You've got maybe 10. Uh, about 30 here. Uh, and 10. So I came out with some rough numbers and based upon what we have here, not including some of the cables that come with it. Uh, I don't know if they're going to move as quick. Um, and there's some other little parts in here. Uh, the brackets, the cover for the power button. I'm going to sell that independently um, so that I can maximize my uh my inventory on this particular item and we're looking at 220 bucks right there and that's before uh any best offers that's before any fees that's before any shipping because some of this stuff is really light in order to get it out the door i'm gonna have to submit free shipping um but i'm gonna i'm gonna wait and see like i'm gonna probably charge for the shipping on this if someone wants it bad enough they'll pay to have it um, the cord, I'll probably do free ship. This I'll do free ship. I'll do free ship on this. I'll do free ship on that. The speakers, they're kind of light. I might keep them though. I don't know. This other stuff, because I'm going to have to add more packing to them, I am definitely might add some, some shipping cost to like a flat rate just to kind of recoup some of the cost and time that's going to take to, to take some care into those. And I have plastic, but I'm not sure. I think it has to be static guard. Um, if you have any suggestions when seeing this, if you think that's what I need, let me know. I would greatly appreciate that. I haven't looked it up yet during the making of this video, um, but I'm sure I'll have the answer soon. So just to go to show that this piece that would have been tossed or thrown out or whatever the case may have been, definitely has value still inside of its components. Take advantage of it. Whether it be this or a microwave or any sort of thing that's got some sort of component in it that you can pop out of there securely, safely, and preventing any sort of hazard that's going to affect the environment, do it. So you could, you know, definitely capitalize on this. This is the one good thing about america and what we do here so thanks for watching i appreciate your time and i will see you next time around and remember the hustle is always a grind